By some estimates now, this Memorial Day weekend has been the busiest for travel in 20 years. Airlines are seeing a record-setting spike in passengers. NBC's Priya Sridhar has more. A record-setting holiday weekend for air travel. I think it's pretty packed for 5 a.m. Yeah. With the TSA screening nearly 3 million passengers nationwide on Friday, breaking the agency's record for most travelers passing through security checkpoints in a single day. The previous high set last year, just a few days after Thanksgiving. People want to get out, have a good time, and, and finally get out to visiting family like they did, you know, five, ten years ago, well before COVID. In total, more than 18 million passengers and crew screened from Thursday to Sunday. Though the vast majority of the nearly 44 million AAA forecasted to travel this weekend did so by car in what's believed to be the busiest Memorial Day weekend in 20 years. The national average price of gas, $3.59 a gallon, down about six cents from last month and around the same price travelers paid last Memorial Day. And while the American Skyways have led to relatively few cancellations this holiday weekend, overseas, Severe turbulence left a dozen people injured on this Qatar Airways flight between Doha and Dublin. We just felt the plane dip for about five seconds, and next to us we saw the flight attendant just go up in the air and come straight back down. This latest bumpy ride comes just days after a Singapore Airlines flight also hit severe turbulence overseas, leaving dozens hospitalized and one passenger died from a heart attack. Back in the United States, many making the return home today, hoping to be in the fast lane. Traffic was not bad at all. Extremely surprised. Priya Sridhar reporting.